What's up? We back. It's a Monday after a long boat day, so we're tired. Uh, Sean's got the lure uh, on Blythe Island. I'm gonna take this uh, Mac to go pick it up. After a long fun day, gotta get humbled real quick. Get out there. And... This thing always wants to act funny when you want to turn the key. There it goes. Yo, just met Sean. We went and got the little from a job on Black Island. She's old girl right behind me. We're gonna go to Camden and look at a few jobs that we got going on. And uh, he said we gotta get two of them done this week, so we got a lot in store. We gotta get with it, or you gonna get rolled over. Well, we left the uh, truck at the gas station for a second. Sean and I rode to Camden. Um, the job's a little bit too wet right now to start, so we're gonna go to the shop, get this little off this uh, trailer, and probably put some brakes on the utility truck and uh, do some audit and stuff at the shop. It's a Monday, so we're trying to get ready for the week. Make it a little easier on us uh, to, to get everything rolling smooth, so we'll start fresh tomorrow. Real quick, we're gonna throw on some brakes on the utility truck, uh, cause they're going bad and we carry a machine right behind us. So we're gonna do that real fast and then we will head out to the job. Get the thing scratched out, do the first step of this thing. Yep, they went from bad to worse. The back's way worse than the front is. We're gonna get to work today, eventually. But we're gonna take care of the crap first. Monday's punching us in the mouth right now. But we about to hit it back. It's gonna be about another hour. Well, we got that off and now the seal's leaking, so you know that old song, Living on a Prayer? We were living on a prayer. Mexican word of the day, though, is what you did you? It didn't bring no brake pads, what you did you? We're gonna try to get this seal replaced. We gotta take this whole thing apart, replace the seal. And then, probably won't be able to make it to the drain for today, but. Part of it. Gotta have working equipment in order to get to the job. And that's just the just the way the world works. Got the damn contusioner bar out with a hydrothermal slat. Damn seal's gone. We get back on. Sean said he's gone. Tissue. Tissue. How to do this the correct way. Alright, in all seriousness. The back of the hub seal went bad. My axle seal, sorry. The back of the axle seal went bad, so we got a new one on there. The brakes are also shot out, so we're gonna put these brakes on there. Got all new brake pads on her. She's stopping on a dime now. Went and looked at a few jobs and uh, changed the brake pads on every tire and also the axle seal, so we're gonna check my truck out. It's been making this weird popping noise on the front end. It's always something, but gotta stay on top of it or get on top of you. The hose tore up and tore down. Got the old axle off. 
It was discombobulated. And I've said every cuss word in the book. Which just did not help a thing. Now we gotta put the new one on and say the rest of the cuss words. So, this old one. It's supposed to look like this here new one. It has been disconfigured, discombobulated, and just about worn slap out. So we had to take all of this apart. The upper control arm and lower control arm, loosen it up. And we'll show it up in there, tighten everything back down, and hopefully get home sometime today. This has been something. Gotta be a minimum of six to eight weeks. Heard a new law. Thank y'all for watching. Stay tuned for the next septic and